everyone, it's Anne here from uh, Anne Makes here on YouTube and AnnMakes.blogspot.com, the blog where I share tutorials on how to make crafting things. I also have tips on saving money for crafting and decorating and making mixed media art. There's a whole bunch of stuff on there. I've been doing that for a few years so you can see uh, some of my other work there. So I went to Dollar Tree. Actually, it's been a few days, uh, but a lot's been going on around here. I've been very busy, so the bags have just been uh, waiting around. And uh, and yesterday we had a, a tornado watch. <laughs> so just, well, there was more water in my basement. Uh, the vacuum oh it's just like a whole bunch of things kept happening so uh and but you know things at least are on the mend now that we think the water situation in the basement has been addressed hopefully <laughs> fingers crossed uh so i want to share with you what i picked up at dollar tree and it's not a big haul i know surprise it's not i don't think it's that big of a haul compared to the last one and others that I've done. So uh, one of the first things I saw at Dollar Tree when I walked in, and I was really happy to see these again, are the organizers. Uh, and by the way, I am speaking to you from Canada. I shop at Dollar Trees that are within Canada. So our items are just about the same as the ones in the US, except we pay $1.25 Canadian versus $1 US. So uh, I really like these acrylic organizing bins. I've used these in my um, bathroom organization, uh, in drawers. I've used them for office supplies. I use them for craft supplies. Uh, and they're just so versatile. So I decided to stock up on a few more because I used up all the other ones I bought, believe it or not. So I thought I'm gonna have some more on hand because I'm not done with my reorganizing and cleaning. And I got some more of these because the last batch I had is now in another container holding my rolls of washi. So I thought, oh, I'm gonna get some more in case I need more. And yeah, I'm sure I'll use these. And these are the, the longer ones. There, There's even some longer ones on this. That you can put like really uh, long cutlery and rulers in. But these, this is the size that I've been using the most inside of drawers for organizing. I have some uh, drawers in my craft room that I organize my glitters in these. So, love to use these. And I was really happy to see that they had more of these bins with the three sections. They go like this because I had a organization system in mine months ago and I would have liked to have had a whole bunch of these to pull off that system. So now I have these. Now I just have to see if I have the other part that was supposed to go with it, which was another basket. So I might have to go back to Dollar Tree. But while I was at Dollar Tree and I saw these and I got really excited, I forgot that this was part of a whole other idea that I had to organize. So I didn't even look for the other baskets. But uh, hopefully I'll go back and they'll have them. Here's something, I don't know if I've never noticed it before or if it's new, but as I was looking in the gift wrap uh, section because uh, my son's having his big birthday this week, my baby, and uh, I saw this lovely gift wrap and I was, well, maybe I won't use it for him. Um, I don't know, maybe uh, it's too girly, but maybe he'll like it too, I'm not sure. But anyway, I picked it up because it looks exactly like the notebook, the other stationary supplies that they have this year at Dollar Tree. The notebooks, pencil cases, notepads, the pencils, pens. Uh, and they also had other rolls that had coordinating prints to all those other um, 
office and school supplies. So I just thought, you know what? These may, are great for, if, you know, when we used to have to cover our books, but you can also uh, use this to cover a box to match your supplies in your office or in your locker or in your bedroom, you know? So yeah, there's a lot of things you can do with this besides wrap gifts. But it's lovely for wrapping gifts. <laughs> All of I found these. I, I've seen these coloring books. I've hauled a few others before. But what drew me to this one uh, this time was the, the quotes. It is full of fun quotes inside. And I just like collecting quotes. And I really, really want to get back into my art journaling and my artwork making. And I just thought, though, this is a good way for me to have quotes that are already made they are i can use these if you're if you're artsy like me these are great as prompts to get you started on another creative idea they're also great for what i thought would be for art journaling and i bought two that way because they the the quotes are printed on double-sided paper that way, if I have two and I want to pull the page out to use the quote in one project, I'll, I'll have another copy <laughs> of the other quote to use in a different project. So this is how I think. So I got two of those. I needed some storage bags, and so I picked these up there at Dollar Tree. They are... Sure fresh zipper seal, wide seal, the gallon size bags, a large size. It's 15 in here. I think it's a good good value for a dollar dollar twenty-five. And I got the smaller freezer storage bags. Uh, they're like sandwich bags, but they're thicker plastic. So there's 16 in here. And these are made in the USA and they're the good sense. So that oh uh, last week i did pick up a case for my new iphone that's filming right now and it's really like a flexible silicone so i feel that my phone is safer in case i drop it and when i was there a couple days ago at dollar tree um i saw they had this one so it's 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 a metallic -y pink and it's also a silicone so it's very flexible, it's easier to put on the phone. So seriously, um, if, if you're like me and you have an iPhone or you have uh, another kind of phone, you know, we pay a lot of money for these things and we need them, we rely on them. And I, I, I wanna protect my investment. Uh, I, I need for them to have something around it so in case I drop it. So I, I love that Dollar Tree sells these accessories for so little compared to, you know, any other store. And they're nice quality, so definitely worth a look-see. I found one, and only one, of these uh, little pop-up round bubble stickers. Um, I hauled a couple packages of the larger size one. The last time I had not seen the small ones when I was there, so when I saw these, I was like, "Oh, I have to get these. I like that they're small." So I got the one that they had. Also, last week I held something that was new to me, and it was the drywall patching putty stuff that comes in the little bag, like a one-time use, but for small repairs. And then new uh, is this interior exterior self-adhesive metal patch it's called the max patch so this is if you create a larger hole in a wall and a drywall wall this might be handy to have because sometimes moving furniture around and doing other renovations in the house things happen so uh, I just thought I would have these on hand in case some other little repair job will be needed I got the LED pumpkin lights my favorite are the pumpkins. I love to use lots of pumpkins at Halloween. Pumpkins and black cats. Those are my thing for uh, my Halloween decorating. So I got these little lights. 
There are 10 lights on a string and it says it's for indoor use only and I had no intention of leaving these out in the rain. <laughs> oh, my Dollar Tree restocked the little command hooks that I love to use. These are great. I use these all over the house for all sorts of things. So I was happy to get more of these and there's two of the smaller ones in there for $1.25 and some more of the refill strips so um, so handy to have these here's another light i didn't realize i had bought three but i did oh our our doors at our house the front doors and side doors are all metal doors so i intend of putting this on one of my doors <laughs> Beware, very cute cat. It's actually ceramic and it's magnetic, but it's perfect. It's our kitty. So, my sense of humor. Uh, I saw these rolls of ribbon. Man, I got there too late because there was barely anything left. So I bought what was left. And this one is brown with some gold leaves on it and this one is like a chevron pattern with the white and orange the brown one with uh, all the sayings on it that say fall uh, autumn turkey thanksgiving i think so cute and this one and these nice autumn fall halloweenish colors just to have for crafting projects of course Oh, and I was pleased to find these, these nice leaf containers, or plates, or dishes, whatever. Uh, and they, they're, they're just like plastic, but they look metallic, which I thought was really nice. And they have these lovely colors. So I got one of each that there was at the store. I got this orangey color, this green one, and this lovely uh, red. So... I'll be using these for holding like candies and treats. Oh, this is completely new at my Dollar Tree. Uh, these are body, yeah, body sprays. I uh, never saw these before at my Dollar Tree. This one is called, this one is called Victoria. And this one is called Pink Blush. I didn't want to start spraying them in the store. <laughs> a lot of people around and you know some people are allergic to perfume smells so I was just like trying to smell them by removing the cap and they the scent seems okay seems nice and yeah they just you know so like florally type of uh, body spray so I'll be giving these a try for dollar 25 who knows you know if, if I don't, if I don't really like them, I'll, not that much, right? So, and if I really like them, you can be sure I'll go back and get more. <laughs> oh, and finally, I have four boxes to show you. Uh, the reason I put the items in the box is because they're made of glass. And I just didn't want them to break while they were rolling around in the trunk of my car. So I thought, oh, yeah, you know, I bought four boxes because I had four breakables. And I'm using so many of these boxes right now because I am a little bit paranoid about water. <laughs> and uh, I'm just storing everything in plastic boxes now. I mean, the cat better beware. <laughs> So I wanted to get a couple of these vases. I got this nice long one. I thought these are, I just think this is a beautiful shape. It's very classic, traditional. You can updo this. I can glass it. I can etch on here. It just, it's just really, I think it's a good deal for $1.25. Uh, I see things like this at other stores and even at Dollarama and they're more expensive. So really, uh, it's surprising what you can find at the Dollar Tree that does not look like you just paid $1.25. So I got that one and I got a shorter one. I am not exactly sure what I will be doing with these, but I love flowers and I'm very fortunate that my husband often gets me flowers and I like to use different vases and 
I just wanted to have these on hand for that and also for some crafting and decorating. So I got these. And so here is you know one of the four boxes I bought again. I buy these often. And uh, my Dollar Tree also had them in a, a whole bunch of really pretty colors. And I just I just use white as much as possible everywhere, except, you know, my craft room. That's a different story. When I don't know where the box is going to go, uh, because I'm just picking up extra, I just prefer to get clear or white, or clear and white. And finally, I bought two more of these bottles with the cork because I saw that the shelves were starting to get bare of these at the dollar store and I already have two red ones and I'm pretty sure I have a clear one somewhere I don't know where it is right now and I just wanted to be sure that I had these on hand and so I can do and thank you to cry crafty share cupcake because she's the one who hooked me up with the little lights there with the cork uh, I have quite a supply of those now <laughs> and I will probably be doing uh, something with the bottle and the little lights just like she did so that is my Dollar Tree haul and yes yeah, surprise <laughs> it's over it's not a long one and uh, so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did I would so appreciate a thumbs up <laughs> or a tail up <laughs> uh, please like comment share and subscribe please if you're not already subscribed I'd love for you to uh, join us and so I want you to take care of yourself and I'll see you after the next haul bye